Good morning everyone, so I'm with Hayley again today. It's Thursday, ooh, and we're about to get hit by a bin. It's Thursday morning and we are just heading to the Tube and we thought we'd go into London today to see if we can try some of London's most Instagrammed food. So these are all the cool like rainbowy, weird things. Yeah. Anything you see on Instagram, like people post things like that on Instagram Pretty all the time. Food. Pretty food. So we thought we'd head to Shoreditch first and we're gonna plan what restaurants or cafes we wanna go to on the way. But I feel like loads of them are always in Shoreditch and areas like that. So we're gonna head there on the tube and we'll see you when we get there. <laughs> a taxi to Brick Lane and we are going to go to Serial Killer Cafe so I always always see this on people's Instagrams and things like that and we've not had breakfast yet so are you excited? Very excited and starving. Kind of cereal they've got. I'm quite in the mood for like a big bowl of like I don't know like Lucky Charms. Yeah definitely. Something I wouldn't usually have. It's been a while since I've been in this booth man. It feels good to be home though. I ordered a unicorn soup. I never thought I'd be saying that, but that's why I ordered. <laughs> and you got a cookie dough. Um, a cookie dough kind of thing. I'm not I really can't. sure what's going to come, so but I'm so excited. And pop tarts. Oh, of course. I pop tarts all the time when I was there. Well, not all the time, but I'd have them every day. <laughs> every day. <laughs> this is what unicorn food looks like. <laughs> and then I got soy milk. Kind of smells like vanilla y though. It smells really nice. Cool. And then. Pop tarts, a pop tart. Oh, I got something cookie dough. Oh, it's alright, don't worry, it's not a problem. Thank you. And then cookie dough. Can I try a, a cookie dough? You are allowed, in? yeah. It won't for the top one. You eat my cereal, I don't mind. <laughs> With vanilla milk. And it's like so nice. Well. Yeah. Right. Let's dig in. I used to record off my S like a freshman here back in the days. Yeah. So every day when I wake up, now the first thing I do is go check my plays. Because I appreciate every fan, every like, every share, and every listen. And these rappers that are quote better than me. Well, why call it a game if there ain't no competition? Yeah. So every day I'll be Verdict. The marshmallow. It looks so good. Go and try it. Yes. Can I try yours? I'll try that piece of cookie dough in it. <laughs> so good. That's what happened. Yeah. And then this will be our next course. Okay. Love pop tarts. These remind me of me and Georgie. My ancestor eating me from the original. It's all like old tapes. <laughs> Okay, so one down. Where to next? That was like genuinely actually worth the money, I think. I feel like if you just got a plain bowl, it probably wouldn't be. But the like mix. The, yeah, home creation is so, so good. good. Like cookie doughy, chocolate chippy, like bits. Yeah. Like that. And mine was just unicorn poop, so like I don't really have anything to say about <laughs> that apart from that it was unicorn. Also, the pop tart is oh, yeah. really good. The pop tart was very. And good. they have so many choices of pop tarts yeah, as well. Yeah, exactly. I mean, five pounds fifty for a bowl of cereal is a little bit excessive, but I feel like the vibe of it, yeah. everything like that, was definitely worth it. Yeah, agreed. Right. Hopefully, next we're going to be finding a rainbow bagel. I don't know what this is going to taste like, but there's a bagel shop here, and fingers crossed they've got them. Because it looks like it should be sweet. Look at that. It does look kind of weird with fish coming out of it, but it looks good. 
Okay, taste test. test. Yeah, meat tastes like a bagel. It's made salmon and cream cheese. <laughs> so it tastes really good. It tastes like a spate salmon and cream cheese bagel with lemon and pepper. What I would say, this was such good value for money. It was two pounds fifty, which is way better than you'd get in like Pret or I don't know, Starbucks or pasta or anything. So if I worked around here, I would definitely get these. I feel like it looks like it should have like that funfetti, and like that should be like whipped cake cream, cake. not cream cheese. That kind but of thing. So you kind of expect it to taste sweet, but it doesn't it taste sweet. sweet. Like it's nice. I wasn't ready for it. But see, it's so good. Look at that deliciousness. <laughs> so we're off to try and get a rose latte. So these like pink. I don't know if they're coffee though. Is it hot coffee if it's pink? I hope so. <laughs> Hayley's like literally coffee. obsessed with coffee, like has an actual addiction. Yeah. <laughs> and I get really anxious if I have like one. So, um, yeah, this rose latte is like a pink coffee that's got loads of like extra bits on top and like flowers and white stuff and things like that. Are you excited? Hilly just got a really boring Americano and I got the rose latte. What is this day tiring you out? Yeah. It's strenuous. I've only had one today, so. <laughs> <laughs> this is my I'm super Instagrammable. Try to try it. Yeah. I'm on this. It looks so pretty. I don't want to read it. It tastes like roses. You can imagine how it rose would taste. It's just like really sweet and milky. It's really nice. Roses. It's really nice. It's very like comforting. So it's a rose latte, but it doesn't have any coffee in it. Yeah. That's what it says. Mine. Mind, but it's really good. It does have coffee in it. So that was really nice, but it didn't have any coffee in. So you're basically paying for like frothy milk that's quite sweet. Yeah. Um, yeah, get ready for my coffee. Ooh, that looks nice. That looks so nice. There's so many nice food spots here. But yeah, you're basically paying for like sweet rose flavored milk. And you actually got a coffee. Yeah, I got a coffee. Which was cheaper it. than mine. Yeah. But a bit boring, I guess. But really pretty and good for an Instagram photo. So I can see why people get it. So we've come to Home Slice Pizza, which I've heard about loads. I've not seen as many pictures of this one to be fair, so maybe it was a bit of a cop out for food. But we really want something savory and like a lunch kind of dinner vibe meal. And everybody has told me that Home Slice Pizza is like absolutely amazing. So we've just ordered a whole one and we're gonna share it. We got like, we chose half a piece each. So I chose the like courgette and artichoke one and Hayley chose the treatso corn and coriander and they both look so good. Yeah, the menu's amazing. I'm so excited. So the outside bit's so cute as well. It's like a little, and then it's in there. A little haven. I love these outdoors. Yeah. Yeah. This is huge. This is like literally. Is it, I feel this is like you can't like even. Me. This is like three days worth of meals in one. I can't wait. It looks so good. Right. <laughs> Struggling a bit there. Good. It looks insane. Genuinely up there with the best you've had. Good because we've got like five days worth of it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, slice number two. Okay, I don't even know how to eat this. It's so big. Okay. It's gonna flop everywhere. Yeah. I don't know which is my favorite. They're both really good. This has got like more flavors to it. Mm. Very, very good. So we couldn't finish it. It was amazing, but I think she lied to us about the amount that we need. This is literally the biggest piece I've ever seen. And considering it's lunchtime, I don't think I can usually eat like a whole massive pizza for like 20 anyway. inch That's pizza. A 20 inch pizza. I mean, that is bigger than me. <laughs> but it was unreal, and I definitely recommend. Okay, 
Okay, what have you got? <laughs> right, I got a charcoal cone with matcha and coconut ice cream and a toasted marshmallow on top. How are you how are you gonna eat that? I love marshmallows. Um I don't know, shall I get straight in? Yeah. The matcha tastes very matchery, which isn't like everybody's taste. Really good. Oh. It's expensive for an ice cream, but it's four pounds fifty. At least it looks good. Yeah, it looks good. Yeah. And the marshmallow, like I was sold when it, they said marshmallows. The marshmallows the same. I don't even know how to eat this. <laughs> A guy just stopped behind you for like while I was videoing you. Yeah, so good. <laughs> We're both a bit full, <laughs> so I'm making Haley eat the rest of the cone. <laughs> so nice. <laughs> she hates me right now. So we just got off the tube and we're gonna go home now because we're both like absolutely stuffed and um, probably won't want any dinner but we've got our <laughs> trusty like two thirds of our pizza, pizza left <laughs> but if you did enjoy watching this video make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in the next one <laughs>